Okay, we're gonna do a, uh, add, gonna add some poses. So we're gonna start uh, in our midsection, draw a two inch line on each seat to avoid uh, a lot of mathematics. And we're gonna do that on each seat that we need our pose. We do it this way because sometimes the seat don't always go back as far as this one do, and sometimes they're shorter. They just give room, uh, make sure you have room around. Make sure your uh, seat starts at least uh, one 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 foot from the floor. Then we're gonna uh, go into Maryland and uh, add our seat pose and slide it up and we just don't uh, 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 select it cut and paste in place and slide it in the direction we need it paste in place Slide it in the direction you need it. And paste in place and slide it in the direction we need it. And paste in place. Slide it in the direction we need it. And then we can just play, put it how we need it. Make sure that you keep your the, the, fa the gr green face facing out and just rotate it like you need it in the vicinity and then delete your lines once you are done with them. It's just the easiest way for me to tell you how to do it. Well you never go wrong. Now we're going to add some standing poses. Make sure you keep saving your work. I'm going to go out and come again, so. So that the uh, poses won't dis disappear once I add one. Okay, we're going to add our uh, standing pose. I don't know, so I'm going to. Uh, slide where I need it. Rotate and then just uh, cut and paste. One cut, paste in place, and slide that one over. Make sure the arrows and rotate and slide it where we need it. Same on this side. Cut. One cut. Face and place and slide where we need it. Okay, now I'm going to sum up in this area. So you keep saving your work. 
Okay, I don't want to move on. Stand in pose. And I'm going to need that one up, up closer to the scope area. So I'm going to slide it down and rotate. in place, slide where I need it, copy, and rotate. Now you got 10 poles, uh, standing poles in there. Pull that up where you need it. Okay, then once you get your poser, you go into my shop, renumber your poses, and renumber your furniture and save you it then you can export and then you just export and then all your files should be in there and that's it for our tutorial on uh, adding poses <laughs>